Okay, what's next on our list here? It's actually the Fidget. And there's not a lot of difference between the widget and the plugin. If we go to our website, our widgets go over in the sidebar. The thing is, the Fidget widget actually installs like a plugin. But first, we have to get rid of all of this stuff in the sidebar so we can install it here. So, in order to get rid of all of this stuff, in your search bar, you may want to add it someplace later. And where you add it all depends on which WordPress theme that you use. Let's go back here. This time we go to Appearance, Widgets. Now the easy way to get rid of all of the stuff out of the sidebar is just grab a hold of this stuff, left click and hold, and drag it over into here. Now if we go back here and refresh, see how that search bar is gone? So let's just do this same thing to all of this stuff. Now when we come back and refresh, our sidebar is empty. So now we go back to our plugins, add new, and we search for Fidget. F E E D J I T. Search. And here it is, right here. Install it. And activate it. Now we go back to our appearance and our widgets. Right here, you're going to see Fidget. Again, you just left click and hold. And drag it right over here into your main sidebar area and just click save and close now when we come back here and refresh there we are you're not going to see all of this of course the reason I have a lot of visitors here is because it's running off my other domain right so this is two different WordPress websites but it's all on the same domain name and I really like how this keeps track of your visitors and when you get to the point where you're going to see Google sending visitors your way you're well on your way okay now so let's go back to dashboard and plugins and what's next